hello everyone you are welcome how to solve and find the value of this beautiful exponential math problem without any calculator which is f raised to power 8 minus f raised to power 7 so here i will try to solve this problem using two different methods here i will use my first method now in the first method here we can write this first number f raised to power 8 is this can be written as f raised to power 7 times f raised to power 1 minus it is to power 8 if you combine these two numbers with the basis same so we'll add the power so it gives him it is to power 8 now there is this 8 raised to power 7 is common in both the terms so we will take out common from both the terms so this will become taking it raised to power 7 common so this will become it raised to power 1 which is simply 8 and we can write this as times 1 so here only 1 will be left now for this will become a raised to power 7 8 minus 1 is simply 7 then we will change this a raised to power 7 to its exponential form so therefore we can write this at as this can be written as 2 cube because multiplying 2 3 times it gives him a raised to power 7 times 7 now here in this one number we will use an exponential identity so here in this tip we will use this exponential identity we can write r s to power m whole s to power n as r s to power multiply the power so r s to power m times n so using this identity here this number will become this will become 2 s to power multiply the power so 7 times 3 is 21 times 7 next we can write this 2 raised to power 21 is the product of 2 raised to power 10 times 2 raised to power 11 times 7 again the base is same so adding the power that gives him 2 raised to power 21 now here we what is the value of 2 raised to power 10 2 raised to power 10 means we have to multiply it to 10 times so it is a very famous number that we mostly use it on in our videos so this is equal to 1024 times the value of 2 raised to power 11 is simply 1024 times 2 but multiplying 2 with this number it gives same 2048 times 7 and we have to multiply these three numbers without any using calculator and without any standard multiplication so how can we multiply these two numbers three numbers first we multiply these two numbers and then we multiply the result with 7 so here we multiply these two numbers for day we will do this first number as the same 1024 times and we can write this number as the sum of 2000 plus 40 plus 8 combining these three numbers it gives him 2048 times 7 now first we multiply these numbers and then multiply the result with 7 so here First we multiply this 1024 with 2000 so this number times 0 is 0 this number times 0 is 0 this number times 0 is 0 now this number times 2 is we have to multiply this number with 2 so 2 times 4 is 8 2 times 2 is 4 2 times 0 is 0 and 2 times 1 is 2 so here the product of these two numbers gives him 2 million 48,000 now we multiply this number with 40 so again this number times 0 is 0 this number times 4 is 4 times 4 is 16 6 one will be carried 4 times 2 is 8 8 plus 1 is 9 4 times 0 is 0 and 4 times 1 is 4 so this gives him 40,960 plus let's multiply this number with 8 8 times 4 is 32 so this is 2 3 will be carried 8 times 2 is 16, 16 plus 3 is 19, so 9 will be carried, 8 times 0 is 0, 0 plus 1 is 1, and 8 times 1 is 8. So this gives him 8192 times 7. Now we will add these three numbers. Now to add these three numbers, we will start from the 1's position. So 2 plus 0 plus 0 is simply 2, 9 plus 6 is 15, 15 plus 0 is 15, so 5, 1 will be carried to this one number, 1 plus 1 is 2, 2 plus 9 is 11, 11 plus 0 is 11, so 1, 1 will be carried to the next digit, next is 8, so 8 plus 1 is 9, 9 plus 0 is 0, 9 plus 8 is 17, so 7, 1 will be carried to this one digit, 4 plus 1 is 5, 
5 plus 4 is 9 next is 0 and next is 2 so here the sum of these three numbers gives him 2 million 97152 times 7 we have to multiply 7 with this number so again we will start from the ones position 7 times 2 is 14 so this is 4 1 will be carried 7 times 5 is 35 35 plus 1 is 36 so this is 6 3 will be carried 7 times 1 is 7 7 plus 3 is 10 so this is 0 1 will be carried 7 times 7 is 49 49 9 plus 1 is 50 so 0 5 will be carried 7 times 9 is 63 63 plus 5 is 68 so this is 8 6 will be carried 7 times 0 is 0 0 plus 6 is 6 and 7 times 2 is 14 so here the product of these two numbers gives same 14 million 680,064 so finally this is our answer and value of this interesting exponential math problem and here i will try to solve this problem using the second method so we'll solve using the second method here second method now to solve this problem using the second method here we will write this problem again now the problem is the question is at raise to power 8 minus at raise to power 7 then we can write this 8 as 2 cube 2 raised to power 3 whole raised to power 8 minus 8 is same as 2 cube whole raised to power 7 now here in both the terms we will use this one exponential identity a raised to power m whole raised to power n is equal to a raised to power m times n so using this identity here you will multiply the powers in both the terms this will become 2 raised to power 8 times 3 is 24 minus this will become 2 raised to power 7 times 3 is 21 next we can write this 2 raised to power 24 as 2 raised to power 21 times 2 raised to power 3 minus 2 raised to power 21 combining these two numbers it gives him 2 raised to power 24 because the basis same so we get the powers now there is 2 raised to power 21 common in both the terms so this will become 2 raised to power 21 times this is 2 cube minus 1 now for this will become 2 raised to power 21 times 2 cube is simply 8 minus 1 for this will become 2 raised to power 21 times 8 minus 1 is simply 7 now this is 2 raised to power 21 times 7 which is this one number 2 raised to power 21 times 7 so we will solve this further using these steps so by solving this with these steps it gives him the same answer 14 million 680 thousand 64